everyone, me again, welcome back to Xamedia X, and if you are a new person then hello to you, don't forget to click that subscribe button, stick around for a while. About six months ago I put up a picture on my Instagram of me in a bikini, looking a little bit heavier and then looking super slim and toned. A lot of people thought it was a weight loss post but it was actually a photoshopped image that I'd done on my phone in about three minutes. We are bombarded with a lot of images online and most of the time those images are pretty damn perfect. And it can be so difficult, even as an intelligent 27 year old woman who works in social media, not to let those images affect you. We all know that photoshopping exists, it happens on billboards, in magazines, on TV, everywhere, but we kind of don't expect to see it on social media. So I wanted to show you just how easy it is to manipulate a photo on and out on your phone and how quickly you can get it done. Okay, so let's take a look at just how easy and how quick it is to edit a photo on your phone. So I'm using an app called Facetune, I think it costs a couple of pounds, anybody can download it. And I'm just using a picture that Joe took of me in Gran Canaria. I really like the picture, I don't think there's anything that needs to be done to it, but I just thought it'd be a really easy example uh, to show you just exactly what you can do with this app. So I've just gone straight into the reshape function at the bottom of the app and I'm just using my fingers to pull the photo, uh, pull my waist in a little bit and give myself a little bit more of a curve. It's literally 30 seconds worth of work and the difference is crazy already. So once you've got the hang of that, which is so easy, you can do that to pretty much any part of your body. So I'm just adjusting the size of my hips so they're kind of in balance and making my thighs a little bit thinner. It's amazing, isn't it? Again, Facetune's such a clever app because it doesn't tend to distort the photo behind it, which just makes it look scarily realistic. You just wouldn't know. Giving myself a little boob job there, making him a bit bigger, lifting him up a little bit. <laughs> it's crazy. All in less than a minute and a half, we've completely changed my body shape scary or what so I guess the only thing that really gives this photo away is the pole in the background you can see it's slightly warped but as long as you're aware of that and you look out for that when you're editing your photo again just a couple of seconds a bit of pulling and pushing around and no one would even know it is so scary and so easy less than two minutes so I'm just going to put these photos together side by side in another app called Pic Collage and then I'm going to put it up on my Instagram page and call it out just in case anybody hasn't seen this video just to give them a bit of a reality check because it's just amazing isn't it? Personally I prefer me in the before photo, thank you very much. There's nothing wrong with having a few wobbly bits or a few curves or being a bit thinner or being a bit bigger or having bigger boobs or smaller boobs or big bums or little bums or abs or a little bit of a pooch. It doesn't really matter. The differences in our bodies is what makes us special and if we're all the same it'd be pretty damn boring. So I want to make a change. I want you guys to upload a picture that's completely unretouched and put it on your Instagram, your Twitter, your Facebook, wherever you like to use best and use the hashtag just as I am. I think in today's world all we do is bash ourselves and concentrate on the things that we don't like or the things that we want to change. So I want to make a difference and I want you to pick one thing if you can find more amazing but put at least one thing that you like about yourself the way your body looks the way you look the way you feel the way you are and embrace that for today we want to spread a positive message we want to show that you don't have to change the way your body looks online you are perfect just as you are so if you are ever looking online and feel bad about yourself because of the perfect pictures you see online just remember how easy it was for me to doctor that photo now I'm not saying that everybody who looks amazing online is Photoshop most of that will probably be just damn hard work at the gym but a lot of the time behind the scenes on social media things like this unfortunately do happen so just take a step back and realize that it may not be as it seems and it might not be as perfect as it really is and if you're an influencer online and you feel the need to ever doctor your photo that you're not good enough that you need to change something in order for people to like it to accept you in some way 
again, take a step back and realize that you are perfect just the way you are. That is the reason why people follow you because they love you for you. But let me know what you think about all this. Leave me a comment down below. Let's get a little bit of a discussion going on retouching online and how it affects people's self-esteem. I wanted to make this video for absolutely ages. Ever since I put that picture up online and we had such a great response. So thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and share this video if you enjoyed it, if you believe in the message that we're sending out. You're beautiful just the way you are. No Photoshop required. But as always, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to click that subscribe button if you are new and I'll see you next time. Bye. I told you it wasn't easy. I don't know if that surprises some of you or maybe it doesn't surprise you. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you thought it was going to be more than that or less than that. Um, but that is how much comes into my account every month.